There is breaking news about Tesla's 4680 batteries already reaching to customers. Tesla Model Y with structural 4680 new battery may already be in production. Owner's manual hints, basically Tesla adds structural battery pack reference to Model Y owner's manual as production is imminent. Welcome back, dear friends. This is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. If you are here first time, please take a moment, subscribe to our channel for daily Tesla news and ring the bell so you don't miss my coverage and give us thumbs up please if you find this video helpful so tesla apparently has added a reference to the structural battery pack to the model y owner's manual as production is expected to be imminent not apparently but tesla has added that reference to the manual of the model y and by structural battery we mean the new 4680 battery while tesla has missed its goal to start model y production at gigafactory texas by the end of the year we have seen several indications that production is now imminent now we get yet another one tesla has updated the us version of the model y owner's manual and it includes a reference to the structural battery pack the structural battery pack is expected to be the biggest difference in the model y to be produced at gigafactory texas versus the current version from the fremont factory instead of several battery modules put together in a battery pack tesla plans to use its new 4680 battery cells in a single block to create a battery pack with structural integrity that becomes part of the vehicle's body. It should not have a major impact on the owner's experience, but Tesla updated the owner's manual regarding the jacking procedure since the lift points are now different. Here is something. It says, note, the following illustration is provided to improve conceptual understanding. If your Model Y is equipped with a structural battery pack, the exact location of the lift points will differ slightly. Check the vehicle itself for exact location of lift points, says Tesla in the owner's manual. This update to the owner's manual would indicate that Tesla is getting ready to deliver the new version of the battery cells to the customer. It's still not clear if or how Model Y buyers in North America are going to know that they are going to get a new Model Y from Austin or the older version from Fremont before taking delivery. Since the battery pack affects efficiency of your Tesla, it is expected to have slightly different specs than the Fremont version, but Tesla has yet to update the configurator because we know that this new 4680 battery cells uh, unveiled by Tesla in uh, 2020 um, September in the Tesla battery day are going to be more energy dense and have more power and will have more mileage and range. Tesla is also going to need regulatory approval, says Electric in its coverage, to deliver those vehicles to customers. So last month, a Model Y body made for a structural battery pack was in fact spat spotted at Gigafactory Texas. There have been rumors that Tesla is preparing to start Model Y production at the factory with the next two weeks, but it's still Confirm it. Although yesterday I reported showing uh, intense work inside Gigafactory Texas, which indicated that Tesla has already started the production, although these may just be the test vehicles. Well, friends, let me know what are your thoughts. Will you be waiting to get 4680 battery Model Y or you will buy Model Y right now anyway? This is Armin Harayan from TorqueNews.com. Please subscribe to our channel for daily Tesla and electric vehicle news. Ring the bell so you don't miss my next coverage. And also give us thumbs up, sharing social media, guys. I would really appreciate it if you found this report helpful. Have a wonderful rest of the day. God bless you, everyone. Peace be with all of you. See you soon in our next report. Tesla Giga Texas may be days or weeks away from starting the production of its 4680 battery cells at Gigafactory Texas. We came to this conclusion after seeing the images shared by Joe Techmeyer this morning from the dawn in the morning of Giga Texas showing 
the activity at Gigafactory Texas battery cell production area. Look at those images by Joe Techmeyer, friends. So see how close they are. The equipment is already there. People are working. There is activity. And do not be surprised that, you know, I'm saying that Tesla may be away, days or weeks away starting from starting the 4680 battery production. Because if Tesla this morning, from what we saw already, started the production at Gigafactory Texas, even for test vehicles, Tesla needs to immediately uh, qu quickly start the 4680 battery cell production in order to put those batteries into their existing new cars that are going to roll off the assembly line from Gigafactory Texas. In fact, in one of the images that Alex Oha, Twitter user, from uh, uh, has, has actually made bigger, you see the rolls. When I said, what rolls are they, Alex? He said, it looks like 4680 electrode rolls to me. And I agree, you know, as you are seeing this video, as you are watching this um, uh, these images shared by Alex. Also, friends, re friends, recently we saw four identical battery production stations that appear to be producing 4680 battery cells coming to Gigafactory Texas. Not long ago, we pointed out that Tesla received several large shipments of equipment of 4680 battery cell production at the new factory at Gigafactory uh, 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 Austin. According to physics engineer Alex, who tweets on Twitter, who shared the images on Twitter, the stations each perform various processes. He says he guesses that the particular stations pictured are for electrode flag patterning, jelly roll winding, and current collector welding. While we can't say we have a thorough understanding of any of these processes, others who appear to be well versed on the subject elaborate on the stations and images in the Twitter thread. So what do you think, friends? Do you think Tesla is really close of starting its uh, well-known and energy dense and new batteries 4680 batteries at gigafactory austin and soon also in giga berlin uh, if based on the images that you are, see on your screen this is armin harian from torquenews.com have a wonderful day please subscribe to our channel for daily tesla news and let's look at the next tesla story from giga texas which we believe has started the production already this the morning. activity at tesla giga texas parking lot shows that the production is very imminent tesla employee parking lot at gigafactory austin Austin is completely packed. If they are not already building cars and hiding them inside, they are very close to starting the production. In fact, according to Dan Ives, well-known analyst and managing director of Wedbush, Tesla's new Gigafactory in Austin, Texas should be set to open in the next 7 to 10 days. He sent out the related tweet on January 8, 2022. So at this point, Tesla could be even closer to that goal already. What's arguably more interesting here at least for investors is that the sooner tesla starts model y production the quicker it can ramp up and make a real impact for 2022 says um, Day and inside evs article keep in mind that tesla cybertruck will follow a successful model y production ramp so timing is of the essence if we are really going to see the first production of cybertrucks arrive before the end of the year Clearly, Ives and his team have been keeping a close eye on Tesla's Giga Texas in order to share details and potential production dates with investors. The fact that paperwork is clearing and the stamping machines appear to have already been tested signals the production is imminent. In fact, we just saw that yesterday another um, Giga casting machine from Hydra came to Gigafactory Texas. Not long ago, we um, I think I had a report with you stating that Tesla production in Texas could start any day. We have also heard that Tesla is planning a big party in Austin, much like the one in Berlin. In addition, some folks have claimed that CEO Elon Musk has a big announcement to share soon. In a related tweet, Sawyer Merritt announced the Tesla Owners Club Austin, another group keeping a very close watch on the happening at Gigafactory Austin, is planning the largest Tesla owner meetup in history. The event coined Tesla Con Texas will happen in early 2022, no, so no surprise, and coincide with Texas Gigafactory's official opening party, probably. Reports from last week pointed out that some areas of Giga Austin are already approved and certified to begin official work, and they've been inspected by the country fire marshal as well. Tesla has been finalizing all paperwork to make sure the opening of the Gigafactory to produce electric vehicles 
vehicles model y process moves forward without pause while tesla hasn't made any official announcements there are plenty of folks reporting about the factory who seem to have an abundance of inside information moreover several tesla fans in the area have been flying drones around the property and keeping tabs on the situation as it unfolds that said according to tesla radi drone operator jeff roberts recently got some footage of equipment heading into an area at giga texas that's assumed to be related to cyber truck production uh, so friends let me know your thoughts uh, what do you think about this development about the employee parking lot like i said tesla employee parking at giga factory texas is completely packed if they are not already building cars and hiding them inside they are very close to starting production let me know your thoughts friends this is armin harayan from torquenews.com please subscribe to our channel for daily tesla breaking announcement that i'm bringing you every day ring the bell so you don't miss my next coverage have a wonderful day give us thumbs up please like this video and let's move on to our next tesla story